I don't like this feeling. Looks like a great day to go find. All right, guys, today is going to be an interesting day. We've got a bit of a weather, and we're going to go try some instrument landings. You can see it looks pretty gnarly up there, but just a thin layer. So great day for practice. We've got Ethan with me. Uh, he's a CFI, a buddy. F double I. F my apologies, CF double I. How can I take one eye away from you? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, what we're going to plan on doing is do what we call an obstacle departure, ODP. We're going to do that out of it. It's called Neural One. Climb up and then connect with the center. First an ILS for uh, runway 21. Do another one, maybe an RNAV for runway 21. We're hoping to get into some weather here. Uh, the clouds are pretty low, so. Power information uniform, time 1853 Zulu. Two visibility 10, sky condition ceiling 800 broken. 1000. All right, so what we got? Eight, 900 feet ceilings, uh, and then it's about a 2,000 feet cloud cover, and then it clears up on top. Perfect day to go practice some of this real instrument approaches. Pocatello ground, sort of stated extra golf, ready to pick up our IFR in northeast hangars. Sirius 88 X-ray Golf, Pocatello ground, cleared to the Pocatello airport as filed. Climb and maintain 8,000. Departure frequency 128.35, squawk 4342. Clear to Pocatello airport as filed. Climb to 8,000, 128.35 for frequency 4342 is our code. 8 X-ray Golf. Sirius 88 X-ray Golf, read back correct. Awesome, good job. All right, so on the departure procedure, we're making a climbing right turn to 7,500. Via the 269 radio, they didn't tell us to climb via the SID. Proceed to 8,000. That makes sense. So, made extra golf. So, they need to climb and maintain 9,000 now. All right, fuel flow looks good. This is on. Flaps are good. 72, rotate. All right, positive climb. Flaps came up. Yo, damper is good. Uh, Marine X-ray Golf, maintain 9,000, contact Salt Lake Center now, so long. Salt Lake Center, Sirius X-ray Golf, uh, departed Pocatello, uh, climbing normal one through 5.4 for 9,000. November 88, X-ray Golf, Salt Lake Center, Roger, radar contact over the Pocatello VOR, I'll indicate 5,500. Position checks, requesting ILS-21, 8 X-ray Golf. 88, X-ray Golf, Roger, we'll have that... Uh, Reaching 9,000, uh, turn right, fly heading uh, uh, 355, expect vectors to Barcy for the ILS to 2-1. 9,000, 355, we'll expect uh, vectors to Barcy to call. Look at that beauty. Beautiful. Wow. <laughs> this is wow. Localizer is 110.3, 11.3. Our approach course is going to be 211. Our touchdown zone elevation 4,450. Our missed approach is climbing to 7,000, direct to PIH VOR. So what you should be doing is build bug brief while you're doing all of it. So we're getting vectors to bars so we can change our uh, CDI needle. 88 X-ray golf, fly heading of a 020. 028 X-ray golf. Why am I taking myself off of GPS right now? You're not using GPS. You don't need it. I'll have to get two vectors. You're getting vectors. So he's vectoring you so that you can have the localizer ready for when he says, hey, fly this heading to intercept the localizer. 88 x ray golf, fly heading of 080. 080, 8 x golf. 88 x ray golf, direct bar C, cross bar C, 9000, cleared ILS 21, Pocatello. All right, direct to bar C, cross bar C, 9000, cleared for ILS 21, 8X golf. 2052. And Westchester 2052, before direct you go, enter, enter. fly over the top here in about three minutes, the regional 7, I'll press down now. Thanks for the heads up. 
All right, so we're going to do a before descent checklist. Uh, Ox is good, all the mirrors good. You can plan on uh, Ludic. Uh, landing lights are coming up, fuel system is good. Oh. Tower, 119.1. Tower, Tower, Sirius is good. Four miles from bars, clear for ILS, 2-1. Sirius 8 extra golf, Pukatel Tower, roger, report has no inbound. Our will report has no inbound, 8 extra golf. Now we're really close, we're within about a minute, so now you can activate. All right, activating approach, 35% power. I'm going to start descending to 6,400, whether it does it or not. Um, uh, autopilot, you're on the localizer glide slope, so it should start doing it for you. Uh, it's doing it. Now just bug the altitude and bug the heading of 211. Okay. All right, we are 600 minutes. All right, 600 minutes. A ground contact. You can see the Mauser runway in sight. Runway in sight, got it. I drop my second set of flaps. Watch your speed. Then I turn off the autopilot. 500. Did you want to do? Do you want to do another ILS there? I'd like to do R nav two one, please. Eight extra golf. All right, we'll plan on that. All right, hand flying this one. We're climbing through seven thousand one hundred for nine thousand here. Got everything loaded in. Looks good. Uh, good day. Beautiful day outside. Second time doing this. This is pretty good. Uh, I'm very thankful to. Ethan for bringing me out here and not yelling at me. I think the first one was smooth with a few hiccups, but we were able to get it going. And twist it to the hold, and you're going to clear the hold because we're no longer doing that. We don't want it to start turning us. Yes, sir. That's important. Thank you. Push the FMS knob in. Tower 88 extra draw, three miles from bars for a full stop for runway 21 on uh, RNAV 21. Here's 88 extra golf, book tell tower. Roger, report has no vertical track. Waterboard has no eight extra golf. Okay, so we're going direct to bars. They're all set. This is so cool. Ain't that the most beautiful view? Look at the view. mountain just popping out of it. That's amazing, man. Incredible. All right, here comes our turn. I'm going to set that up. And uh, go ahead and set my altitude down to... 6,400. It's already there, so it shows up. All right. I'll do vertical here, because the glide path is not there, right? Uh, your uh, your target is catching up to your requirements, so it's going to start down. Here's what happened on this approach. ATC told me stay at 9,000 at bars. I hit approach, expect my airplane to start down. Nothing happened. On R and have the vertical path won't capture if you're high. The autopilot will not dive to save a hot high airplane. 
you still have to manage the energy. So the takeaway, get down to the public step down altitudes early with VS. Confirm the glide path is armed from below. Probably at final approach fix. And if you're too high, don't force it. That to stabilize. Bring it back to idle for a second. Oh, we were way too high for this sucker. That's what the problem was. Oh, we we're same altitude as the last one. It just didn't work. We're gonna fly through these clouds now. Approach is on, nav is not on. This is where I get behind the power curve, I hate it. I don't like this feeling. And I have speed, everything looks good. And seat belts are good, fuel pump is good, make sure it's good, we're gonna go to the fullest tank. Flaps will come off. Glide slope's alive, so. Yeah, glide slope's alive. I dropped my power to about 30% at that time. All right, we're approaching Hesno in a mile. Like, we're a stable approach. I don't see any icing, which is good. All right, dropping the first set of flaps. Pulling the power back to 30. Go ahead, report Hesno. Tower 8, X-ray Golf, Hesno. Cirrus 8, X-ray Golf, runway 21, cleared to land. Runway 21, cleared to land, 8, X-ray Golf. Now look, your autopilot's following the glide path. Yep, it is. Getting some moisture. Not bad. We're in the soup. Let's see how long it takes to get out. Still don't see any icing, outside temperature zero degrees. 1,000 feet to minimums. 1,000 to minimums. All right, still in the soup. 500, 500 to minimums. Ground contact. Pulling power back. Still don't, oh, I see the Mauser, the Pappies, runway in sight. All right, runway in sight. 5,000 almost. All right, dropping the... Oh, the autopilot. Set. Alright, autopilot coming off. 500. Heck yeah! Blocks are coming up. Sir, thank you. Build boost down. His landings are getting difficult for whoever's gonna follow up. I mean, these <laughs> greasers. That was very good. Good fun. A lot of fun. Thanks for coming with me. Had a blast. I'll put uh, I'll put these all final monitor ground in extra. All right, good. Very much. Very sorry good. about that. Alpha three, alpha monitor ground. The clearance, you have to read it back. Yeah, you're you're a stickler, aren't you? <laughs> I'm just trying to make you good. Ah, uh, you are. I appreciate it. Great day. We'll see you next time. I hope we all learned some stuff. So, thank you. <laughs>